What's going on guys? John here from John's Fishing Channel. Thanks for tuning in to a special episode uh, today. This week I've been down in St. Thomas in the U.S. Virgin Islands. And I'm going to be doing a little shore fishing today. Right down here at a nice rocky beach in a place called Megan's Bay. Uh, hopefully it's a good day of fishing. There's tarpon down here. There's grouper down here. There's sharks. I mean there's all sorts of different types of fish that I could catch. And I actually have a real good possibility of getting a few fish uh, on shore today. So probably not going to keep anything. Just kind of enjoying some time down here for my brother's wedding. Uh, but St. Thomas is a wonderful place. Uh, I got a video of us catching an 87 inch sailfish as well as another 60 inch sailfish at the same time the other day. So I'm really looking forward to posting that video for you. But I thought I'd make just a quick little short beach fishing video here at Megan's Bay, St. Thomas in the U.S. Virgin Islands. There's an iguana. What's up, man? How you doing, iguana? You having a good day? He won't bug me. He'll just kind of stay there and do his thing. Where are we fishing today? Man, so I climbed down like kind of like a little rock wall over here and was fishing an eddy and all I brought was my fishing and I left my tackle up here. Nice big fish. I believe it was a tarpon. It was huge and it was silver. You know, it was like 30, 40 pounds. Just grabbed my line. That's like, that's a good spot to fish. Cast out there, wham, hits it. Just takes off running, clips me off on a rock. So that was, that was so disappointing. But it was awesome to see that fish. So I came back up here. I'm gonna get some more tackle. I'm gonna head back down, but that was exciting. Well, I've been at it for a couple hours here. I uh, missed maybe four or five fish. I lost all these gold rubber minnows I was using, so I fished over a white one. And fish, uh, like six or seven fish, and other school of fish are all following the bait back to the shore, but they're not eating it, which leads me to believe it's probably not something they're interested in. So I'm gonna figure out a way to get some frozen squid, uh, maybe some more rubbers uh, to throw onto my jig heads there. But uh, I'm gonna give it a, a little bit of a rest. It's starting to get windy and wavy. It's getting really turned up and choppy down there. And it's just not that great for fishing because the fish can't see that far. So I'm gonna wait a couple hours and get back at it. 